Hello and welcome to another Britain's Best Bay Roads. I hope you had a lovely Christmas. Santa was good to you. As you can see for mine, I got a lockdown haircut, which was very nice. Um, it's New Year's Eve here, or Hogmanay as we call it in Scotland. I uh, have no idea why, I don't think anybody does. What you can see is that it's very cold. You can probably see my breath uh, in the garage. We've had snow for the last week, forecast to have it for a number of days to come, so no chance of getting out and about in the car. Also we're in lockdown, so we can't. Anyway, but this time has given me um, an opportunity to reflect on what I actually want to do with the videos that I'm producing. As you've probably seen, uh, if you've watched some of the videos over the last couple of months, the format has been quite uh, varied. Uh, and I think it'd be good to get a bit more clarity and consistency over what I'm trying to do with these videos. So in this short video, I wanted to give you an update. Two things. One, what's happened with this black Porsche, and two, what I want to do with the videos that I'm creating in 2021, if we get a chance to go out and actually do some, some road trips. So the first thing, the black Porsche sold on eBay, which is good news. Um, unfortunately, it was for quite significantly less than uh, what I've, the amount of money I've put into the car, so that's, that's not so good, but that's the price that we pay for um, wanting to change out, uh, change our cars and change projects. But, as often happens with older cars, it has left me with a, a little leaving present, a little Christmas present. Um, with about eight hours to go on the eBay auction, and bearing in mind you can't change a listing within 12 hours before, the, before it ends. So with eight hours to go, I thought I'll take the car, a quick drive, just make sure everything's uh, working on it as I described it. And in that short drive, the clutch pedal decided to no longer come back up fully. You put the foot in the clutch, take your foot off it, and it would only come back about halfway. You could put your foot under it and pop it up, but it wouldn't come back on it on its own. Um, gears were changing fine, no grinding, so the clutch was engaging, and it was pulling through the gears, there was no loss of power or clutch slippage, so the clutch itself um, was okay. And investigating it, um, it's the clutch slave cylinder, the seal on it is, is leaking and obviously letting air into the system which stops the pedal coming back up because it's a fully hydraulic system there's no cables or springs or anything uh, in the clutch system in this car so we'll get this car fixed um, hopefully in the next couple of weeks when the part arrives and off she'll go to her new owner who'll uh, finish up the little bits and pieces that are left to do on the car and she'll make a really good solid car for for him i hope he enjoys them the second thing i wanted to give you an update on in this video was what my focus is going to be, certainly for 2021, uh, with the videos that, that I produce. So what is it that's really inspired me to create, create these videos? I love cars, but I'm never going to be the best car reviewer in the world. There are lots of car reviewers out there who are better than me, who have access to much more interesting cars than I will be able to get access to. So for me to create videos that are about car reviews isn't really adding anything to what's already out there on, on YouTube. The thing that's, that I think is missing, the thing that I want, I would want to see on YouTube is much more about the road trips themselves. The things that have inspired me that I have seen are things like Henry Cole's motorcycle rides, you know, the greatest motorcycle rides. I want to do that, I don't ride a motorcycle, but I want to do that in a car. Things like Harry Metcalf from Harry's Garage, where he goes his big road trips to the south of France. Um, or to the Sahara and his Testarossa, the, the, the escapism that I feel when I watch these these videos, it's what I want to be, be part of. You know, books like books like these, Take the Slow Road for Scotland by Mar Martin Dory. Okay, he did it in a camper van. Um, I quite like to do it in a sports car rather than a camper van. And Thousand and One Road Trips. You know, books like these, they really inspire me. And for years I've been circling road trips and putting crosses on them, the road trips that I want to go on and I never seem to have the time to do it. Well, I'm fortunate now that for the foreseeable future I'm going to have a lot more spare time than I've had in the past to go these road trips. You know, when I used to drive to work and you're coming up to the cutoff that you should take or the slip road to take for your work, the number of times that I've felt a longing to just keep going, keep driving and go a great drive that day instead of going to my work and I never did. But now I can, and that's what I want to do. And I want to create videos to, to let you all share in that escapism that hopefully I'm going to get the chance to do the, this year. So that's what the videos are going to focus on. 
The majority of them will be done, hopefully, in this 944S, which I've decided to keep. And on a previous video I said that she was up for sale, but she's a, she's a great car, um, and I love driving her. And I think she's going to be a really good road trip car, a good blend of GT qualities. She's got a decent size car, decent size boot and back seats, good comfortable seats, and a sports car as well. So I think she's going to be a really good car to do these road trips in. Um, we've also got the McCann GTS and some other cars that we can swap out if we need to. But that's it, this channel's not going to be about really reviewing cars because there are lots of other uh, videos out there that, that do that and lots of channels that do that. Um, you know, th there may be times where we're back in the garage. If after a drive I think, actually, this part of the car could be improved upon. You know, maybe it's the brakes or the suspension or the exhaust system or, or whatever it is. Um, and I decide to do some work on the car to improve it or to fix something which will inevitably break. You know, it's a 32 year old car, <laughs> things are going to break, break on her. So we might do some videos that are back in the garage but the majority of the videos um, will be road trips. And because of that, uh, I probably won't post another video, I would guess, until end of January, maybe February. Once lockdown restrictions, hopefully, fingers crossed, start to lift, uh, lift a little bit. I won't actually be able to go out and, and do these road trip videos until then. So that leads me to say thank you very much to all of you who have watched so far. Thank you for your support and those who have left comments and to those of you who have subscribed. Please rest assured that once lockdown restrictions are lifted and once the snow, snow lifts as well, then I will be back out on the road, um, hopefully living the dream and doing some great road trips. So hope to see you then. Thanks for watching. See you next time. And have a happy new year. Hope you have a great new year and hopefully 2021 is uh, a lot better to all of us than 2020 was. See you next time. Bye bye.